Australian researchers today said they have detected a low-frequency underwater noise off India's southern tip at about the time MH370 mysteriously disappeared, as a British woman sailing from Koki to Phuket in March claimed that she may have seen the plane on fire. The researchers detected the mysterious noise, possibly that of an ocean impact recorded by two undersea receivers in the Indian Ocean about the time the Malaysia Airlines plane ceased satellite transmissions and vanished on March 8 with 239 people on board. The researchers released an audio recording today of the underwater sound that they say could possibly be related to the final moments of the missing Boeing 777. It's not even really a thump sort of a sound. It's more of a dull oomph, Alec Duncan, a senior marine science research fellow at Curtin University near Perth, who has led the research, told the New York Times. The general vicinity from which the noise emanated is a large area of the central Indian Ocean off the southern tip of India and about 3,000 miles northwest of Australia. But that is not consistent with calculations of an arc of possible locations in the southeastern Indian Ocean where the plane might have run out of fuel. Those calculations were from Minmarsat, the global satellite communications company. Scientists have struggled to figure out the origin of the noise. If you ask me what's the probability this is related to the flight, without the satellite data it's 25 or 30 percent, but that's certainly worth taking a very close look at, Duncan said. Adding to the uncertainty surrounding the plane's possible final location, a British woman sailing with her husband across the Indian Ocean from Kerala's port city of Koki to Phuket in Thailand has claimed she may have seen the plane on fire. Catherine T. 41, reported on Sunday to the Joint Agency Coordination Centre, Jack, that is leading the MH370 search that she